Ethylenodimine is the organic compound with the formula C2H4, NH2, 2. This colorless liquid with an ammonia-like odor is a strongly basic amine. It is a widely used building block in chemical synthesis, with approximately 500 million kg being produced in 1998. Ethylenodimine readily reacts with moisture in humid air to produce a corrosive, toxic and irritating mist, to which even short exposures can cause serious damage to health. Synthesis Ethylenodimine is manufactured industrially from 1. 2 dichloroethane and ammonia under pressure at 180AA degrees Celsius in an aqueous medium. In this reaction, hydrogen chloride is generated, which forms a salt with the amine. The amine is liberated by addition of sodium hydroxide and can then be recovered by rectification. Diethylenetrimine and triethylenetetramine are formed as byproducts. Another industrial route to ethylenodimine involves the reaction of ethanolamine and ammonia. This process involves passing the gaseous reactants over a bed of nickel heterogeneous catalysts. Applications Ethylenodimine is used in large quantities for production of many industrial chemicals. It forms derivatives with carboxylic acids, nitriles, alcohols, alkylating agents, carbon disulfide, and aldehydes and ketones. Because of its bifunctional nature, having two amines, it readily forms heterocycles such as imidazolidins. Precursor to chelation agents, a most prominent derivative of ethylenodimine is EDTA, which is derived from ethylenodimine via a synthesis involving cyanide and formaldehyde. Hydroxythylenediamine is another commercially significant chelating agent, precursor to pharmaceuticals and agrochemicals. Numerous bioactive compounds contain the NCH2CH2N linkage including aminophilin and some antihistamines. Salts of ethylene bister the Okabama TE are commercially significant fungicides under the brand names MAMB, Mancos, Zymb, and Metirum. Some imidazolin-containing fungicides are derived from ethylenodimine. Role in polymers, ethylenodimine, because it contains two M groups, is a widely used precursor to various polymers. Condensates derived from formaldehyde are plasticizers. It is widely used in the production of polyurethane fibers. The PAMAM class of dendrimers are derived from ethylenodimine. Tetrastylethylenediamine, the bleaching activator tetrastylethylenediamine is generated from ethylenodimine. The derivative N, N ethylene Bs, stearamide is a commercially significant mold release agent and a surfactant in gasoline and motor oil. Other applications, as a solvent, it is miscible with polar solvents and is used to solubilize proteins such as albumins and casein. It is also used in certain electroplating baths. As a corrosion inhibitor in paints and coolants, ethylenodimine dihydroiodide is added to animal feeds as a source of iodide, chemicals for color photography developing, binders, adhesives, fabric softeners, curing agents for epoxies, and dyes. Polyamines derived from or related to ethylenamine, ethylenodimine is the first member of the so-called polyethylene amines, other members being, diethylenetrimine, abbreviated DEAN or DETA, triethylenetetramine, abbreviated TEN or TETA, dethylenepentamine, abbreviated TEPA, pentethylenehexamine, abbreviated PEHA up to polyethylenum. Similarly piperazine is an analog of dioxin. Related derivatives of ethylenodimine include tetramethylthylenediamine, 2NCH2CH2N, CH3, 2 and tetraethylethylenediamine, 2NCH2CH2N, C2H5, 2. Chiral analogues of ethylenodimine include 1,2-diaminopropane and transdiaminocyclohexene. Coordination chemistry. Ethylenodimine is a well known chelating ligand for coordination compounds. It is often abbreviated N in inorganic chemistry. The complex, co, ethylenodimine, 3, 3 plus is an archetypical chiral tris chelate complex. The Seon ligands, some of which are used in catalysis, are derived from the condensation of salicylaldehydes and ethylenodimine. Safety, ethylenodimine like most amines, is a skin irritant. 
it was used in commercially available skin products including Nicolog cream. Unless tightly contained, ethylenodimine will release toxic and irritating vapors into its surroundings, especially on heating. The vapors react with moisture in humid air to form a characteristic white mist, which is extremely irritating to skin, eyes, lungs and mucous membranes. Exposure to a relatively small amount of vapor or mist by inhalation can seriously damage health and may even result in death. Ethylenodimine has a half-life of about 30 minutes and a small volume of distribution of 0.133 liters per kilogram. After oral administration its bioavailability is about 0.34, due to a substantial first-pass effect. Less than 20% is eliminated by urinal excretion. References External links, Iris EPA Ethylenodimine, CDC, NIOSH Pocket Guide to Chemical Hazards, Chemical Data.